Friends, welcome to my workplace at Ranaghat, West Bengal, India. This is a totally unedited surgery. We have planned fake emulsification of this soft cataract with use of Mohanta's spray chopper. The ocular surface has been thoroughly irrigated, applying few drops of povidone iodine. Now I take a 2.8 millimeter steel keratome, and here goes the main incision at mid limbus. And now the anterior chamber is filled up with 2% hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose. A side port is made on the left side of the main incision about 3 clock hours away. And now capsulorexis is being done. We are using the stereo coaxial illumination of Lumera T microscope and it has beautiful red glow. And now hydrodissection is done with BSS and 27 gauze cannula. The nucleus is rotated just few degrees. And now here goes the Mohanta's pre-chopper after injecting visco. The left hand instrument is sustainer, the right hand instrument is the pre-chopper. The sustainer hooks the opposite equator and the pre-chopper cuts the lens mass in front. So, we have got four pieces out of this soft nucleus. Visco has been again injected and now here goes the fecal needle with its bevel down. Some superficial lens matter is removed and then one piece is picked up and emulsification is started. In few seconds one heminucleus is emulsified. Now we come to the other heminucleus. The first piece of the other heminucleus is emulsified and this is the last nuclear piece. So the surgery becomes almost effortless if we breach off the nucleus. And now I am using the handpiece itself for removal of some cortex. I am not encouraging you to use this instrument. It is maybe dangerous unless you are habituated to this. So, better to use safer instruments for cortical cleanup. You can use bimanual irrigation aspiration, coaxial irrigation aspiration or Simco cannula. The Simco cannula has been used and all the cortex has been removed. And now the posterior capsule is polished by the irrigating probe only. The irrigating fluid is swept over the posterior capsule and all the cells that sticks to the posterior capsule are dislodged. The main wound has been enlarged to about 3 millimeter and here goes a hydrophobic acrylic single piece monofocal intraocular lens. The cartridge was B cartridge that is why we have enlarged the main wound to about 3 millimeter. The intraocular lens has gone into the capsular bag and now this is a bit of moxifloxacin and then the side port is closed by hydration of corneal stroma. A final lavage of the anterior chamber is done with the help of BSS and Simco cannula. All the visco that sticks to the corneal endothelium is removed at this time. The anterior chamber is nicely formed, integrity of the wounds are checked and the case is concluded. Thank you very much for your attention. Hope this video will encourage you 
to use Mohanta's pre-chopper. Surgery will be effortless if we can divide the nucleus, especially soft cataracts, into three or four pieces.